Well, let's talk about uh, soybeans. It's report day and drum roll, please. Uh, we didn't really get anything that was going to shock anybody. Um, you know, the managed money, the funds, they were looking to get rewarded today on their bearish bets. Really hasn't come to fruition. I would say that if you kind of take a look at a 40,000 foot view, like the, the airplane view of everything, look, we had lower exports, uh, higher production, um, but the market's kind of held in there. I don't think there's anything in these numbers uh, that's going to give anybody any real reason to kind of wait in now suddenly, right? Um, we, we have had, obviously, the coronavirus to deal with. And I think that a couple of things, uh, interesting enough, um, Conab came out last night, I guess it would have been, saying that they see record corn and soybean crops coming out of South America. So I suppose that would have been bearish news. Markets kind of held up with that. Uh, the market's still holding up with coronavirus. But I would also have to put out there that the most interesting thing I saw this week really was how are we going to judge when the, the Chinese really come back online? Um, and I think one of the things that was really intrigued me was, uh, yes, there's been everybody talking like they do about the USDA. Do you trust the numbers or the Chinese giving us the right uh, details? Um, but you know what? If you, There's something that, that they can't really manipulate, and that's pollution. And we saw some studies done over the last few weeks about a significant drop off in pollution. Uh, and depending on what city you're looking at, it, it was fairly dramatic which means that they're not online, right? I mean, it means they're not really doing what they were normally doing back before they had this virus. So we're going to kind of keep an eye on that, and I'll, I'll update you as we go. But that is something that they really can't manipulate. So let's keep an eye on that. But again, report day today, nothing really to light your fire. Bears were looking to get rewarded. They really kind of didn't. Um, what's the world going to have to look like to see things kind of sell off even more? So keep an eye on that. <clears throat> the next report we'll have more phase one in it too. So that's going to be something we'll have to watch. Uh, but this market's been beat up pretty good. We've had a you know, 92 cent drop. We've seen the market come back 25 cents. Be careful about getting too short in that scenario. Um, and, and again, things have held in pretty well. So all in all, um, I'm not going to say a nothing report because we did get some good data out of it. Uh, but we didn't see the bears get, I think, rewarded like they wanted to.